I saw that we were invited to the same festivals all the time. Then I realized that people started to have an image of what African music and dance should look like. So the same people who love everything about us just have that image and then they couldn't change it anymore. So then I decided to create what we call Dafra Kora Band because Dafra Kora means the new Dafra, which is the new face of Africa. Because Africa is the village and Africa is the really uh, emerging cities. And when you go to African cities, it's, the fever is high, people are excited, innovation is everywhere, building contemporary arts, music, and you see east, west, north, south music like uh, coming together in one, one spot. So it's so much creativity. It's still inspired by traditional arts, and then, you know, the meeting between modern and traditional. The country of like open bars and DJs and griots singing and people throwing money on them and just like having fun and going out and the Burkina we know and then it goes back to the Burkina I see today and trying to hope for another Burkina tomorrow. One, two, three and four. Is it okay? Huh? One, two, three, four. Is it okay? Four. Huh? We, the artists, became the voice of the elders who are tired of screaming. We, the artists, became the voice of the whole nation. And then we went in front, in front of those guns. We were standing there. And we were ready with a mic. We do it for necessity. We do, we do it because it's some, the only way for us to survive. Right now, I need dancers now. Please come on, 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 come Thank you, Tennyson. We love you. Thank you so much. Thank you.